Hello everybody, it's me Scooter with Outbound Backyard Wrestling. I just got off work and we're about to go. Hold on, I gotta turn my music off. The wrong song while you're down the road making a video. You can literally copyright your You can literally copyright your whole damn video and then nobody will be able to watch it. I'm about to back out. Okay, it's coming, so we're gonna put this bitch in reverse and we're gonna go take off. Okay, we're heading to my dad's house right now to get the trailer. Then we gotta stop and get, and then we're gonna stop off at one of the gas stations and get him what he wanted was four packs of beer, which four, that's the kind they want, they make him four and he wants eight eight beer total and they come in a four pack so that's what we're gonna get him for the trampoline he wants it out of his yard we agreed on that I'm going to go I'm gonna get it somebody's humvee broke down Then we're going to uh, get it, get the thing. We gotta get the trailer. We gotta get what he wants to drink. And then we're gonna have to pray that this thing is worth a damn because I haven't seen pictures of it. I don't know what condition it's in. I don't know if the bouncy thing has rips in it or not, but I'm trying to hurry up and get to my dad's house load this trailer on i hope the grass ain't wet because it has been sprinkling so and i don't want to get stuck in the backyard that would suck so what we're going to do is we're going to go and we're going to load this trailer up okay and we're going to put the trampoline on there it's a nice little drive and um and all so yeah we're gonna do this i might pause the videos here and, like when i'm doing the trailer and and all that but i'm gonna get what he wants but if i get up there and the trampoline don't look as good as i think it should or meets what i think it should be then we're gonna have to negotiate on this beer thing because, you know, I'll probably have to do four or five because if I get done, because like I said, I'm going, I'm looking at this thing blind because I don't know what it looks like. I don't know what condition it's in or nothing like that. So pretty much I'm going in this blind. I should ask for pictures, but he probably doesn't know how to text a picture. So I'm just going to go and see what we got. I'm almost my house. I got a few more turn curves I gotta take and then we're gonna be uh, putting the trailer hooking the trailer up and then we gotta take off and I gotta be careful when I'm pulling this because I don't have no lights thing to plug in they go for my dad's truck they don't go for mine so I have to you know be careful when I'm dropping this thing because it don't have no lights and I don't have no way to plug a light into it but yeah, we're gonna go. We're gonna hook up this trailer. I've done it a hundred times. I've, I've hooked up this trailer a hundred times. I've hooked it up to everything that we have, pickup lambs and all, so it won't take me that long, maybe a few seconds. But we're gonna go, we're gonna hook this thing up, and then we're gonna be on our way down to his house, because I told him today we'd come and get it. And then, we're going to come and we're going to drop it off down here. They leave their damn garbage can. Why can't they not just burn it? See, they didn't even tie a knot in the damn bag. It's going to end up all over my fucking damn yard. See, it already has.
See, the animals have already got into his damn trash. And there's my ball scraping on the ground like usual. I'm just glad the ground is dry in my backyard because the last time it, I got stuck and it sucked and I, I had to wash this thing out and drain down the driveway. Okay, we're going to go. We're going to back in. And we're going to hook this damn thing up. Okay, everybody, I will be right back. Okay, everybody, we went. We got the trailer hooked up. It only took me a few, few seconds. I had to drag it. But we're going to go now, and we're going to go and see what this damn gun thing looks like. What kind of shape or condition it's in, for that matter. So, yeah. Oh, God, Lee. These damn holes in the yard. There we go. Yeah, it drove a little bit. go and I'm gonna tie a knot in this guy's goddamn garbage bag because if I don't I'm gonna end up getting damn trash all over my goddamn yard because people can't tie a knot in their damn trash bags. Okay. I had to tie a knot in a damn trash bag because people are too damn lazy. That's what you gotta deal with in this world. Fucking lazy ass people. Can't even take two seconds to tie a damn knot in a garbage bag. And then the shit's gonna get all in my yard. But anyway. Now we're on our way to go and we're gonna go I'm gonna get this guy's okay here we go damn damn pothole ain't no joke back there man like whenever that house finally got rented in the people flushed god knows what down the toilet and they literally had to get somebody to come and dig that pipe up and unclog whatever in the hell they flushed down it and it was crazy that's why i would never rent that house because they the plumbing is probably ain't worth a damn and they're going to figure that out whenever they eventually in time put the chains on and I made sure you always try to yank up on it when you get it on the ball and you click that finger on your pin you always try to yank up on it that way you can make sure it ain't gonna come out if you're a bump or something that way you know it's nice and it's secure I mean it's got the chains anyway so it wouldn't go nowhere but still I'd rather be safe than sorry Definitely on our way. The only thing I ever worry about is 
was having that ball on the back is how many people have hit their legs on that damn thing when I'm not around? Like, you know people do it. Hell, I've seen people do it at Walmart. So I got to do it, and he tried to yank the thing out, and I said, sir, you got to remove that kingpin. You can see that boat right there? You got to pull that kingpin out, and then you can throw that damn thing across the parking lot. He didn't know that. And I said, and it's got one of those square locks on it, so you got to have a key to take it off. So you're, you, you might have hurt your leg, but you're not going to be able to sling that damn thing, because he was trying to take it out and swing it. I guess it was going to make him feel better swinging it. Yeah, we're on our way. Like I said, we'll have to stop at this. We gotta go a long way. We gotta go almost to Abernat. Or it's Abernat somewhere down here. It's past Allison's junkyard. Bobby Allison's or Bobby's, I don't know what his name is, but it's down here. And we're on our way and we gotta go a little bit past that and then we're gonna go. And then you turn it and then you got up this road and you gotta go a few more miles so I just know I wanna hurry up and get this done because it's New Year's Eve and everybody is gonna be out rascal drinking and doing what? I'm not gonna be doing that. I might go to Logan's. That's about as far as I'm gonna go. I might have one or two beers and then I'm going home. Because I don't want to be out in the road when these people are, you know, everybody drinks and drives a little, you know, but I'm not one of the little. I'm, I could care less. It's just another day to me. Everybody sitting there saying 2020 was bad, wait until 2021 comes along. Because that's the age you can start drinking. So 21 might just turn up to be even worse than what it is now. And I haven't, and you know, and everybody's happy. Everybody's getting $600. You know, they're like, oh, I got $600. Y'all, $600 is not going to pay nothing. I don't know why they sat there and made a big deal about $600. $600 ain't nothing. That might pay your home mortgage depending on where you live. Or it might buy you groceries. That's about all it's going to do for you. I mean, really, so $600 ain't nothing. I can't believe that he didn't go ahead and just give us 2000 2000 that would have helped out a lot of people. But, you know, whenever that guy's time comes around to get reelected, if he does, they need to just go ahead and kick both those house speakers out. And that Mitch McConaughey and that other one. Hey, what in the world? I just saw a vehicle out in the middle of the woods over there. I don't, I couldn't make it out what kind it was. But yeah, we're on our way. And, uh, we got to go down this 216 highway. And it's a nice little drive, but I got to stop off at the lick, at uh, get the last gas station and hope they have what he wants. I'm sure they will. I just want to hurry up, get this thing home, get assembled, and hope to God that it ain't going to be, you know, a problem. Because I'm just going to put it right behind the other one. So if people want to wrestle in the ring, they can. If they want to wrestle on the trampoline wings, they can. You know. going to speed limit because I'm not Tuscaloosa they like to hide in bushes and everything else and I'm about to hit their li limit here in just in a minute because that's having two trampolines I mean 
like we got one trampoline and I and I have to be so very careful when I'm jumping off that top rope or off the turnbuckle because I'm scared literally that I'm going to end up jumping to the end of it because I have came pretty close. I could probably jump to the end of it if I wanted to. But when we get that second one, it ain't going to matter then because I'm going to have that one there and if I accidentally bounce, I can accidentally bounce onto that second one. So... But if you haven't watched the Silent Night pay-per-view, Foxy won all the belts, right? Well, three of them, needless to say. And, um, well, she managed to win it again because she's lightweight. And when Triple H went to hit a power move, Foxy went flying. And he said, I saw her flying and she was... I thought that she was not going to make it over the fence, but she made it over the fence. That fence and hit the ground. I was very shocked to say the least, but I told Foxy and I told that little Maui Wally Panda, when they get killed or gets destroyed, that's it for them. We're not going to have no little small ones. We're going to have big ones from here on out. And an 18-wheeler with spinners on the front. I wish I could have my radio on, but they hear any bit, a little bit of music, the wrong song can just kill your whole thing. I hate not having music on, but it sucks. ACDC, if you play one of their songs, it'll kill your whole, you, you can't hardly play it nowhere because of their copyright. This light changes green. Okay, it went green. But we're officially in Tuscaloosa. And when I stop at the BP, I'm probably going to pause, pause it. I get to the BP I'm gonna pause it and then I'll restart it whenever we get to his house house because it's I'm telling y'all it's a long drive but yeah I mean I tried to get other people's trampolines around my neighborhood because I said, you know, I talked to people, I said, hey, I'm, I'm interested in this trampoline. Ah, oh, no, I can't tell you that the kids play on it. I said, when? When does the kids play on these trampolines? Everybody I talked to said their kids play on these trampolines, but every time on my off days, I drive by on Tuesday and Wednesday, there ain't a soul out here playing on this trampoline. Now, my next door neighbors, the ones that moved into that house, their kids are out there religiously bouncing on that trampoline. It, <coughs> but hey, I mean, and I'm going to tell you something. If you go right now to any store trying to find a trampoline, you are about going to be shit out of luck because most stores do not carry trampolines anymore because they're not hardly bought. That's why. And when people buy them, the kids might play on them maybe one, two days, and then guess what? They're tired of them. That's what happens when you get a trampoline most of the time. The kids will play on it for a few days, 
get tired of it and go like and I and I see people making backyard wrestling videos you know it's like most people now are using nothing but trampolines and they put ropes up around them it's like nobody hardly has a ring anymore like I think there's like a few people that actually have rings but you know that's their YouTube channel I mean I, we, we're trying to be different so we got both okay I'm gonna stop this is the Cisco so I'm just gonna hope that they have it in here he said the BP but I don't know where another BP is so I'm gonna pull up here out of the way okay everybody I'm gonna pause this video go in here get what he needed and then we're gonna uh, start the video when we get back at his house hello everybody I'm on his street now and I gotta remember how to get there because like I said I haven't been down this way since years and the road is actually paved the last time I came down this road it was dirt from it was gravel and they actually put some material down on it and my trailer is bouncing up and down like I don't know what it's South Shore Drive whatever the hell that is it might as well call I feel like I'm driving out the goddamn Crystal Lake I, I gotta remember how to get to his house like I said it's been a long damn time since I've been up here been to his house in a long damn time I probably GPS wouldn't have done no damn good but I think I got a it's hilly as hell I hope I don't lose it shit the neighborhood watches they kill you and throw your ass off in the wood okay, we're going. like I said I haven't been to his house in a while and not really sure where the damn thing is or where it's at for that matter. I know I turn this off some damn road right up here. I just hope we don't got no damn dogs. Oh, we got two damn dogs, one standing in the damn road. Go chase my well they were started I thought they were gonna chase my damn tires hopefully they didn't okay like I said I haven't been down here in a while for sale by owner yeah I think not Officially in no man's land now. If I start hearing banjo music playing, I'm getting the hell out of here. Okay, I think we're almost there. We just gotta go around this damn curb right here and up and going, I think. Like I said, it's been. hill a steep hill and then I think we go up I, like I said it's been forever since I've been down this way the last time I went down here I shit you not the road was nothing but dirt and then the next time I came down it was gravel they've actually paved the thing I, I, I can only imagine how long this road's been like this I'm trying not to go too fast because you don't know who's coming around what. I 
know there's a saga you can hook it like that and go to his house. I'm just going to keep letting the video go at this point because I think, I think we turn, yep, I think we turn right here. specialty drive. I might have to put my thing into a special gear because his driveway looks like a goddamn washed out. not even at home and that'll be a righty, I guess. Oh, that's nice. Okay, everybody, we're here. Now we're gonna go. We're gonna check out this trampoline real quick. Let's see here. Okay, that's it right there. This is the trampoline that he was talking about. I'm looking at it. Um, it looks okay. That's a big damn trampoline. Hmm. Well, good thing I got tools because it's going to take some. I don't think he's even here. Okay. That's it, y'all. That's trampoline. God almighty. Well, you can see he had the fang around it, so that's in good shape. Damn. Got that. That ain't no problem. I'm gonna have to yank those off. Damn, this might take me some time to take this shit off. Put it back together. Look at that. It's got fucking acorns. Can't put that in my truck at all. Damn. I'm gonna have to put the springs in my Tahoe. But yeah, I brought him four. I can bring him some more later. But yeah, this is going to be a job. Like, getting the springs off, getting these off. Man, this is going to take some time. I didn't know it was this epic. But everybody, listen. I'm going to end this video now. And I've got to get to taking this thing apart. And, um... God almighty, man. This is a mess. But everybody, I'm going to end this video now. And I'm a, I'm, I gotta get taking this thing apart. This is a mess, man. I mean, there's two. Golly. But yeah, everybody, I got, I gotta get to work. This thing's gonna be a mess to take apart. Until our next video, y'all have a nice day.